right, uh, Nitin asked a question regarding Microsoft Teams meetings. I am covering for my manager to run his meeting in his absence. What a nice just guy. Out, yeah, that's great. <laughs> uh, just out of curiosity, I joined the meeting today, which is scheduled for Monday, to check the options regarding sharing. I accidentally shared the content and I ended. May I know if the members will be able to join this meeting on Monday? as the chat window show the meeting ended, or should I send out another invite? I am worried this is a pan-European project and a lot of people are involved. Tear face. Oh. Yeah. Look, and it's not like you can't start the meeting again, ultimately. Well, that's the that's the first yeah. answer to that. It's like, yeah. Yeah. it's still Unless, there. It's still on it. everybody's calendar. Yeah. You can just yeah. start it again. Unless they did events and, you know, for quite a while with events, it's if you started it, you were done. So, uh, you know, you couldn't restart it. But um, if it's a team meeting, it's a matter of what did you, what have you potentially got in there? Did it auto restart, auto start a recording, for example, that you might need to remove from the chat and delete because you're, if you're the owner, if you're not the owner, you're going to have some troubles with removing anything that you might have put in. Yeah, so the persistent meeting, the links are forever, it seems like, mm. because it creates a unique meeting link for every meeting you create. And I can always click that link and it'll say, you know, that meeting's in the future or it'll say waiting for somebody else to let you in or, you know, yeah. that that space or, is there. I, I, I don't I don't know how long those stay active. I do so believe I do believe if you don't. So if you set up a meeting link, I do believe if you don't log into that meeting link, I want to say it's 90 days, but don't quote me on that. Um, within a certain period of time, it eventually the link will actually die um, because I was reading something on that. Somebody asked me for that a while back, um, but it's I a think, really long time. I think that's a setting, Sharon. I think that yeah. as an admin, you have the ability to go and set what that is. Maybe I, I took the team's admin cert. It might have been on there somewhere. I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> but this is where you notice, like when I, it, I'm sure we've all when I've organized a meeting and I've we've gone in there and like uh, three of the four people show up and we end early, we wrap up, and then the person who is like comes in late and restarts it again. You know, so I mean, there is a, a meeting that we have actually ended it. Uh, and yet the link is still live and others that were invited can go and jump back into it. So occasionally I've done that and seen that and I jump in, see the one person be like, yeah, we wrapped up early, so we're done. Yeah, but sorry. Thanks for coming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for being late, which is a strategy, as we all know. Meetings you don't want to go to. <laughs> yeah, just I just I'll give you the I'll send the link. It says the meeting URL will never stop working. It only expires if it's a PTSN sort of dial-in number or um, uh, underlining meeting policies. It says the note that a team's meeting though has the limit of thirty hours. So I'll copy the link and I'll put it into um, into chat. No, that's great. I know they've changed quite a bit over the last couple of years, so yeah, that's good yeah. to have the correct reference for right now. But be forewarned, this could change at any time. <laughs> While we were talking, it may have just changed. We don't know. <laughs> you just described the cloud. <laughs> the magic, the opportunity of the cloud is that it. It's yours. Changed. Yeah. It's interesting when you go in, it states that. But when you go in, it says a meet now start time plus eight hours, a regular with no end start time plus 60 days. Meeting expires after the a regular with end time is end time plus sixty. Recurring with no end is plus sixty. A recurring with end end of last occurrence. So, so that's straightforward. That's what you're saying. I do mm. know, like mm. there are certain <laughs> meetings we've had that if nobody logged into them for a certain period of time, when you go to click on it, it says something like this link has expired or something. So I know that there was some. Seems pretty arbitrary. <laughs> It's what it, I'm telling you. That's what I'm saying. Like, I mean, and ask again tomorrow. I'm sure it'll, it'll be probably different. change. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat>